The best places to use your planters in Bee Swarm Simulator. Hello there and welcome to my video. Today I will show you the best places to plant your planters in Bee Swarm Simulator. To start off, if you need stingers, use planters in the cactus field, preferably the candy planter. It grows in about 4 hours making it a fair source of stingers among other items. Since the release of planters, field dice have been extremely easy to get, making field boosts easier and quicker to prepare. The best way to get these is to plant the tacky planter in the clover and sunflower fields. You can get anywhere between 4 to 20 field dice using this method. The best way to get jelly beans and gumdrops is to use the candy planter. Although you can get the occasional gumdrop from a plastic or paper planter, they aren't nearly as efficient as the candy planter. The best field to plant it in is in stump. An average reward from this is for jelly beans and 20 gumdrops. Now for our final item, and arguably the most important, waxes. These are used to craft the endgame equipment and are extremely valuable once you get hold of them. It is difficult to tell what planter and which field you need to plant it in to get these. But what I can tell you is that they can be rarely dropped from. A candy planter in cactus field for a swirled wax. A tacky planter in sunflower field for a caustic wax. And a red clay planter in pine tree forest for a swirled wax. That was all. Thank you for watching my video and don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see a part 2.